Hello, great souls and friends from all over the world. <laughs> we are Ruby and Jivanka. Jivanka. <laughs> and we are very happy to share this special moment with you today. And let's start with a prayer to invoke the presence of the masters. Inhale to the spiritual eye. And exhale, relax and center yourself. And let's pray, Divine Mother, Divine Mother, Heavenly Father, Heavenly Father, Friend, Beloved God, Friend, Beloved God, O oh, Great Masters, O oh, Great Masters of Self-Realization, of Self-Realization, Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ, Baba Ji Krishna, Baba Ji Krishna, Lahiri Mahasaya, Lahiri Mahasaya, Swami Sri Yukteswaraj. Sri beloved Guru Deva, and beloved Guru Deva, Paramansa Yogananda Ji, Paramansa Yogananda Ji, all saints and sages, all saints and sages, we bow to your feet, we bow to your feet, beloved Mother, beloved Mother, be with us now, be with us now, open our hearts, open our hearts to your infinite love, to your infinite love. Purify our hearts. Purify our hearts. So we can perceive your presence. So we can perceive your presence. Ever more deeply. Ever more deeply. And help us. And help us. To become your channels. To become your channels. Ever more pure. Ever more pure. Ever more yours. Ever more yours. So that we may share. So that we may share. Your love. Your love, your light, your light, and your joy, your joy, with all the world, with all the world. Om, Om. Shanti, Shanti. There is something about master teachings that I really love, and I always feel very inspired about it. You probably already know, but masters say that there are two ways to go closer to God and gurus. One, of course, is go inside in your deeper, deeper and deeper meditation. And the other one is outwardly serving God, be in the world and serve everyone around you. And for me, it's so much inspiring because it's what I got to learn through Ananda Yoga, through my daily practice. I don't know if you know about Ananda Yoga, but when you go into a position, all your body express vibrate of a certain quality, like joy, peace, calmness, power, wisdom. And what in true you're doing is you're trying to get in tune and channeling divine qualities, divine power into your body. And more you tune in that, more you transform in that, and more you become that quality. And this is the second, let's say, way of Master saying, got closer to God. So serving, be your channel, and just have his power flowing through your body. And the second part of Ananda Yoga, when you exit to a position, you always take a moment of pause. And usually that pause is as long as the position was. And that's like how you can really train yourself for, on the first way to really go deep into your meditation, to really get a way to bring all the energy into your spine and then again up to the spiritual eye. And for me, just because this is, let's say, my daily bread, is what I really try to learn from Master. Like, okay, so in my way to express out, I really try to channel it that these qualities, this power, this love, this light. And then at the same time, I take the same effort to just try to come back to the center and really go closer and closer to God. And more I train myself on that, more it's easier to do the same out on the world after. In every action, we can all do the same. Really try to express it fully out with master power, with master light. And then again, take just a minute or a second to pause and remember the second way 
or let's say better the first way, is to go inside and up again to God and gurus. And I want to read the words of these two paths. The master say, these two, these two paths, service and meditation, there are true approaches to God realization, the outer way and the inner or transcendental way. The outer way is to love and serve mankind. The transcendental way is by deep meditation. When many devotees follow these two paths, there will arise a true united state of the world with God and his love as a man's director and guide. Let's just close for a second our eyes and really try to feel these two currents. One goes out to the world to reach everyone, every art, every mind, every soul. And the second one is go back to God, to your source, to that point of origin inside of us. And then after this beautiful inspiration, I just want to add a dimension to that. And first of all, I want to really thank everyone for being with us today. It's a really special blessing and honor to um, be together today. And <laughs> because I've been on the other side of the global prayers for many months now, as we have been doing this since a year, basically doing all the technical part. And so I had many occasions on being present you know, when we all got together. And I really feel, and I hope you can also feel that, you know, there is a really true power when we also all come together, you know, and practice exactly what Jivanta was describing, you know, the twofold ways. One, to go really deep inside, but then also the second one, to really act as channels for the divine love, for the divine power. And I feel, and I think you might have felt that too in the past global prayers, if you have been present, you know, there's a really tangible feeling I feel when we are all together, you know, so many times I was sitting right at the computer and there were only, you know, two, three people with me in this temple, but it felt like we were so many. It felt like you were not alone. And I think that's really the power of, you know, also the collective prayer and, you know, how important it is for us as a spiritual family to, to come together and to unite our strength. And I feel in those moments, I really have an experience, I think, of how powerful the prayer can be and how we as a spiritual family really can make a change in this world, you know, through these moments that we are sharing right now, you know, where we all amplify and multiply our efforts to really send healing and send light to the world that is so needed. And, you know, that can really make a difference. And I felt it personally many times being here, and I hope you can have that same experience. And I would really encourage everyone to take time and to really come together so that we can all be one and serve together as channels of light, as warriors of light for this world. As the affirmation says so beautiful, I join my brothers and sisters everywhere. Let's join brothers and sisters everywhere <laughs> to bring light to this world. So let's try now to really spread the, this light everywhere around the globe. Close your eyes, sit up straight, like 
just take a moment to really feel this first way to go back to God, to really go really deep inside and up to the spiritual eye. And just try to mentally visualize that you turn and look at your back and behind you, you can see Swami Kriyananda blessing you and you can perceive his blessing flowing through your heart, hands, whole body. And behind Swami Kriyananda, there is our Guru Paramansa Yogananda that's, that is blessing you through Swami and directly to you. And again behind Yogananda you can see Sri Yutekshwar and again he is blessing Yogananda Swami Kriyananda and you, each one of us. And behind Sri Yutekshwar, Lahiri Mahashaya, just feel his power that is flowing through Sri Yutekshwar, Paramansa Yogananda, Sri Yutekshwar, Swami Kriyananda and direct it to you. And behind Lahiri, you can see Mahavata Babaji that is blessing you through this line of Gurus. And behind Babaji, you can see Jesus Christ that again is blessing you through this divine line of gurus. Just absorb this divine ray of light coming into your body and you become a channel of this power. And now again mentally turn back to your normal position. But keep feeling all this divine blessing infusing you, making you strong, making you a pure channel. And now get ready for the second path to get close to God, to really serve Him as a channel, to really spread this light into the world. As a warrior of light, And now why you keep in working. <laughs> Aware of these blessings from the masters behind you. You yourself now can send your blessing strengthened with the blessings of the master. Strengthened with the blessing of all our brothers and sisters to this whole world, all souls. And in that inner state, let's affirm this affirmation. First with a loud voice and then ever more silent. 
God's light is within me and around me. God's light is within me and around me. With the sword of faith in my hand. With the source of faith in my hand. With the love of God in my heart. With the love of God in my heart. I am a warrior of light. I am a warrior of light. I join my brothers and sisters everywhere. I join my brother and sisters everywhere. To overcome fear with faith to overcome fear with faith hatred with love hatred with love and disease with health and disease with health we are all warriors of light we are all warriors of light we fill the world with god's light we fill the world with god's light god's light is within me and around me god's light is within me and around me. With the sword of faith in my hand. With the sword of faith in my hand. With the love of God in my heart. With the love of God in my heart. I am a warrior of light. I am a warrior of light. I join my brothers and sisters and everywhere. Join my brother and sisters everywhere. To overcome fear with faith. To overcome fear with faith. Hatred with love. Hatred with love. And disease with health. And disease with health. We are all warriors of light. We are all warriors of light. We fill the world with God's light. We fill the world with God's light. God's light is within me and around me. God's light is within me and around me. With the sword of faith in my hand. With the sword of faith in my hand. With the love of God in my heart. With the love of God in my heart. I am a warrior of light. I am a warrior of light. I join my brothers and sisters my, everywhere. I join my brothers and sisters everywhere. To overcome fear with faith. To overcome fear with faith. Hatred with love. Hatred with love. And disease with health. And disease with love. We are all warriors of light. We are all warriors of light. We fill the world with God's light. We fill the world with God's light. And now mentally at your spiritual eye, holding that visualization. God's light is within me and around me. With a sword of faith in my hand, with the love of God in my heart, I am a warrior of light. I join my brothers and sisters everywhere to overcome fear with faith, hatred with love, and disease with health. We are we all are warriors of light. We fill the world with God's light. And remain for a second. Continue to send blessings to the world. Feeling the blessings of the masters behind you flowing through you. flowing to the world, all souls, all people, everyone in need is getting touched by this light. And let's Chant three ohms, infusing the whole planet with these divine vibrations of our Kriya Masters.
thank you, great souls, for being with us today. And may you continue to act as channels and warriors of light this day and all days.